Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. And it is mostly going to be Valentine's stuff. I know. Um, I got a few things that aren't, so we'll start there. And then I have some Valentine things and I'll tell you why I got it. Um, speak and span, because, you know, we got to clean our house. Uh, this is, I don't know what scent this is. They had green and yellow. This is citrus. I think the yellow is pine. So I got that. And then for some crafty business, I grabbed some of these little seed bead kits. I need these little size beads, the little ones. And I needed pink and green for a project. I hope to get started soon. But first, I have to get this cross stitching done that I am in a daily stitch along. Um, oh, I picked this up because I love horseradish and mustard, and it's a decent sized jar. And honestly, for a dollar twenty-five, I like sausages with mustard. Mmm, that smells delicious. I love mustard. Okay, so that's it for food. Oh, I grabbed these, which I think they're for your fingernails. It's loose metallic pigment pigment powder. Oh no, it's for your eyes. Okay, okay, okay. It's pigmented eyeshadow. It's loose. So you get this purple color, this bluey color, and this silver color. So we should see how pigmented it is, right? Because it's a dollar, but says I can use my finger. So let's find a trash bag. I bought some glass items, so trust me, they got me lots of trash bags. Um, so let us, let's, we're gonna do, okay, well, first of all, look at that fun container that they come in. Now it says it's loose, so I'm trying not to make a mess here. Oh. All right, what's happening? We do have, okay, we have, we have, um, oh, it's got plastic over the, just the, um, here we go. I wonder if I can, no, okay. So it has like the holes in it. So, but well, yeah, it had plastic over that. So we're not gonna do all the colors. I'm just trying to list, loosen up some pigment here. Okay, we got some. And since I don't have, I mean, I don't, I don't know about all that. It doesn't seem so pigmented to me. Could it be fun? Sure. Will I play with it? Yeah. But I thought it was for my nails. But anyway, it'll be fun. I got silver, purple, and this like blue color. I think it'll be fun. So we have that. And then the other makeup thing, I wasn't quite sure what this is. So I decided, well, then we should buy it. Um, because... I know that it's a name brand when they repackage them into these little bags. Oh, I guess I could have just opened it at the store. It's that, I know it's flower. Or I thought it was flower. Nope, it's Maybelline. Uh, highlight and concealer. So it's a highlighter and a concealer. So I think this is my conceal. I, I don't know. Maybe bronzer and concealer. Questionable, but it's a brown. Okay. Well, that was it for makeup. Um, I found these. I'm not sure if you can see it. I'll open it. I'm not doing anything for New Year's, but I did think this was fun. You get a two-pack. They are champagne flutes. They're plastic, obviously, but 
look at the gold. And they're not a bad quality. Now, could I do without the seams from where they did this, the molding? Sure. But for champagne, for New Year's Eve, I love this. Super pretty. So I grabbed those. I'll be home for New Year's. I'm not a go out on New Year's Eve kind of person. And I may end up renting the Taylor Swift Eras Tour show. Oh, I should show you what this is. This is not Dollar Tree brand. This is called Serve, or the brand is Serve, and you get four glasses, right? So they're just like solo cups, and they're pretty cheap plastic cups, but they have um, glow sticks, and you pop them, and the glow stick goes under here. It snaps in, so the top of your lid glows in the dark. And um, everybody knows, because they're all different colors, everybody knows whose drink is whose, right? I thought these would be fun for the summertime to go to picnic with the pops. So I should probably buy a couple more sets of them if I see them. But you, so it makes your, your drink cup glow. I just thought it was something fun. And in the summertime, I think this would be perfect because it's dark downtown at the picnic and I do love me some glow sticks all right put this away so I definitely will use this New Year's Eve I have I'll get some Prosecco or champagne or something and if I I will not make it to midnight let's be truthful it's not happening but you try um and then these are back out these snap tight containers. I've had them out the last couple of years. I absolutely am obsessed with them. I love them for storing um, craft items. They have the flatter ones. They have the different sizes. I think they have, uh, it's like tall and skinny and they had this one at my store. They go fast. Now I know you can order them by the case, but I don't need a case. I just need a couple of them. I like this size. I'll show you. Um, they're clear, which obviously, so I can see what I have stored in them. And they stack nicely on top of each other, right? And then they have a matching handle. I love these. Um, I love them for like beads. This will probably be for my sequins and beads that I'm doing. Because, um, again, I can see inside and put them. I'm going to be exchanging or cleaning out my craft closet soon and kind of purging some stuff that I don't use and um oh my shirt says not today cupid um yeah so I'm going to be cleaning it out all right valentine's day stuff this is what I found at my store so far um I grabbed two of these they're nine foot long so that um thingy I made for my desk for Christmas. I'm going to redecorate it for Valentine's Day. This is nine feet long, but I feel like I'm going to need more to wrap around. So I grabbed two of them, but I love the metallic and the soft pink. So I grabbed these. I probably will wrap the, um, the PVC piping in plastic, or I'm sorry, in ribbon, like pink ribbon first, and then go over it with that and then I grabbed these I like these but also um you, they open up but they hang so I can I want I'm gonna go with a pink white and red theme and I can hang these off of my deal if I choose to go that route so I just grabbed a pack of these if not you can put candies in them and gift them they're cute they have these every year this is not new uh what I did find is new look at these hearts and again, this will be fantastic for um, with my sequins and stuff because I can paint them and then stick a bead in the middle and stitch them down. And this is just wooden shapes. There's a hundred little hearts in here, but it's a Valentine theme. So these are new to me. Um, these are new to me this year. And th these may not all be new to you. I know that for a fact that Dollar Tree's cycle things 
my stores in my region did not get the Christmas tree printed dishes because I was looking for them. I really would have liked those for the holidays. But these are new to me. They are like the um, the viral ornament or um, or, yeah, the ornaments for Christmas that you can write somebody's name on here. And I thought that was fantastic. I may end up hanging this from my dealie and I just put Wellington and Alex because they're cute. Um, they had the gnomes, they had snowmen, and then they had little envelopes. I should have got the little envelopes. They won't dangle as much. It doesn't matter. I grabbed these. And they're like um, like a play, clay or a pottery but, or rubber plasticky material. But you can use Sharpie. I did it. Got that. I don't know if this is new or not. I feel like it's not, but it's, um, you can't really see it. But it's, it is um, heart trim. Oh, oh, what's happening here? Whoa. There's a lot on this one. It's this heart lace, which I think is adorable. This has, it says it has three yards, which I think is a lot. Usually it's like nine feet, but three yards. And I think this is just super fun. And again, you can make little ornaments, do little crafts. You can make uh, Valentine cards and attach some lace to it. Let me put that on there. So they just come like this. And I know they'll get more. My store is just putting stuff out, but I wanted to grab it. Um, they also had these gnomes, which are stinking adorable. They have their little fur and their plush and the little bead, but they hang, and then you get two of them. And again, probably for my office decor. Um, and then there's just a couple things left. So it wasn't a huge haul, but it was new stuff. So I almost tinkled a little bit when I saw these, how excited I am. And this will be our thumbnail picture. These are glass lid comes off you can fill them with candy there was only one pink one left so i grabbed the pink look at their little faces painted these are Greenbrier, and it just says valentine glass container um fill it full of candies you can fill it full of change put pennies in it whatever i would say filling it will you bring out the picture better and then there is i don't like these tags on you know i don't like tags but these also especially because they're in the legs and then they had it in red i know and then the last one i saw this is also glass is a candy jar look at this lid these were not in the five and or three and five dollar section these were in the dollar 25 i didn't get anything in the plus section and they didn't have anything in the plus section for like valentine's or spring or anything like that um this is again green briar yeah i am definitely taking this to work and i'm going to fill it up with candies and put it on my coffee station at the office for everybody to share so that was everything i picked up so far from the dollar tree um my stores are pretty run down on Christmas stuff. So I'm really hoping after next week, um, they'll have some spring out or Valentine's. This plus sections are all wiped out in my stores. There's nothing left in stock. I also overheard the manager talking to somebody about how they get to keep their name, the Dollar Tree. And apparently, and take this with a grain of salt, I just overheard it and I don't know how knowledgeable this woman is or whatever but she said as long as they have a few items that are under a dollar they can call themselves a dollar tree and a dollar store and so the woman must have been like you have stuff under a dollar she said there are things like cards that are two for a dollar they have baking soda that they keep in stock and there's one other item she had mentioned that's under a dollar and that is how um, they get to keep the name the Dollar Tree, even though their prices are going up. So I found that interesting. I thought I would share. Again, I don't know how truthful that is or if that, you know, whatever. This is just what one of the manager ladies was saying to one of the a customer. 
But that is everything I have this week for the Dollar Tree. I hope you enjoy and you had a fantastic Christmas. And let's get ready for the new year, guys. 2024 is our year. All right, everybody, have a fantastic day and I'll talk with you later. Bye.